All right, well, welcome back to my Mario Luigi Super Saiyan Play. In the last part, we infiltrated Balletta's castle, and now we're going to be fighting the first of the seven Koopalings. And it is Iggy. Yes, it is. Now, this is the third thing I like about this game. Pretty much, the the Koopaling boss fights and the puzzles leading up them kind of get really, really hard later on. But this one's pretty easy. All he basically does is make you dizzy, and then he makes your controls reverse. Not like multiple rules, just like it just means like left is right and down is up and up is down, that sort of thing. But you have to deal with these flame balls, which gets really annoying. See, as you can see, I gotta get used to this. Have to really get used. Oh, never mind. It's the other way around. Oh, God. No, it's right as. T no, I kinda forgot how it went. This probably makes a lot of safe saves during these puzzles, because puzzles get really annoying. No, it's. Oh, now it's not doing what it's supposed to be doing. Look up. Safe state here. I have to get used to reverse controls. So I'm so used to the old controls. It's really annoying. It's going in figure eight, so. It's really, more or less, it's going in figure eight. There we go. Not to do is bump into him and then we can fight him. Okay, here we fight the first of the Koopalings. Now, the Koopalings can, in fact, be lowered to defense. I recommend you do that first. I recommend you just lower the defense first. Just so you can make the fights easier. Let's just use Thunder Bros and take him out. There we go. Now his defense has been lowered. He has two attacks. He does a fireball and he does this. And I'm also going to say this right now, I'm not going to be fighting every single enemy, random encounter in this game, in this area, not this game, this area, like before, because these enemies are really, really difficult, and I am low on items. So you might you might not see me fight a lot of enemies during this portion. You will see me fight the bosses, but not the enemies. That's just to save me some trouble of having to go back go back to Beaming Castle Town and get items. Just save me some time. Because I will have to go back sooner or later. See, this fight's pretty easy, now his defense has been lowered. Yeah, these guys have really high HP, and now here's the second attack, it's just a good fireball. Just bounce it back at him, and you'll, you'll do fine. It's been a long time since we fought a Koopaling. I mean, really, it's been a while. It's has been Super Mario World. But, don't, but I'm sad that other than ROM hacks, they have not yet to appear after this game, so I'm pretty much assuming that after this game, they died. I'm pretty much assuming that they died. Yeah, I'm pretty much assuming they died. Alright, now this way, if it was a longer area, those blue portals will lead you out, out of there, but I just, since we don't need the blue portal, let's just go, let's just go down. Oh, no, we, no, wait, no, we need to go through the blue portal. Clues to the door. Yeah, like I said before, I'm ignoring enemies right now. Those are magic Koopas, but those things are really annoying to kill. And I don't recommend fighting them. I'll kill you. I'm not fighting any more enemies. I'll fight them off. Uh, uh, if you want to know what those enemies do, watch someone else's walkthrough. Because these those enemies are really annoying. I'm just not going to fight them at all. I'm just going to fight folks more on the Koopalings. Okay, here we go. More of this. This mini game that I freaking hate. Actually, I don't really hate it. It's just it's just it's random. There we go. That just saved my skin since I don't really feel like fighting those enemies since I never really liked the enemies in, this, in the, the, the encounters in this area anyway. I mean, the Koopalings I can fight perfectly. I just don't really like to fight the... Speaking of the Koopalings, let's give me some more of the... Oh. Oh, I, oh yeah, I guess going through the blue also recharges your health. I forgot about that. Look, I think here we have the next Koopaling. Uh, no. Yep, here's the next Koopaling. Morton. No, yeah, Morton, I believe. Now, here we have another annoying one. Like before, you have to time your jumps perfectly. I'm good leveled. Uh, I really think the only like, hard boss in this is like some of the Koopalings, because some of them act like timers. Oh my god, I gotta time this jump. I have to press both A and B at the same time just to fight this thing. There goes fight Morton. 
Okay, yeah, the time bomb doesn't start until, like, I think at the Wendy fight. I'm pretty sure they're going Super Mario World Order. Yeah, they are going Super Mario World Order. Oh, God. Yeah, they are going Super Mario World Order, so next will be Wendy. I wasn't sure if they were going Super Mario Bros. 3 or, or Random Order or the Super Mario World Order. They're going Super Mario World Order. Alright, let's use a... No, we're not going to use a nut. Just yet. No. How oh, fine. Which is attacks are pretty much easy to dodge if you know when they're going to land. Oh. Great, Luigi died. Yeah, well, Luigi died, but that's only mainly because the end, this thing is hard to dodge. It's hard to see. Well, I saw it that time. Uh, Max Mushroom, I'm not using. I was using Ultra Nut. Max Mushrooms heal up your entire HP, but I don't feel like wasting that. I won't need that. Okay, he does the same attack that Iggy does. He does like they each have their like own like signature move. Okay, now I'm not even dodging it right. There you go. Forgot. The goblin fights can get really annoying. If you let them get annoying. I guess this is why Nintendo never used Gooplings ever again. Cause they're too freaking annoying. I mean, they're harder than they were in like the original Super Mario Bros. Super Mario World. They're, that's how more they're more harder. Oh god, that's just great. Just kill it, kill it. You bastard. I said to kill it, but you missed. There we go. Morton's dead. Two Kooplings down, I believe. Now I have a Max Mushroom. I mean, Max Nut. A few more to go. Yeah, you will be facing about eight mini bosses. Of course, you'll be fighting Foul Flaw. Then you'll be facing. You'll be facing the Seven Koopla, Then you'll be fighting Foul Flaw. Then you'll be fighting Foul Letta, of course. I'm curious. Does that refill your health? Yes, it does. I never knew that. As I said, I haven't played this game for like three years. No. Okay, I guess I gotta show this fight now. Magic Koopas. They're annoying as fuck. As you can see, they're annoying as fuck. God, they are annoying as hell. Let's just kill them. Before they kill me. This is the only time I'm showing a Magic Koopa fight. This also may be the one time I'm actually going to save state during a fight. I save state during fights off camera because the fights are really annoying. I'm not sure how much HP they have. I'm not sure you can lower the defense. Okay. Oh god. And they lowered their HP. Well, that'll be this will be a good place to end off this part to the next part where I go through more of the more Bowser's Castle and fight the rest of the Koopalink. See you around, guys. Bye.